What's going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I'm going to show you guys what in my opinion is the fastest way to farm exotics as a fire team. But before we get into that guys, do you want to win some juicy loot? If so, I have exclusive emblem calls, I've got exclusive sparrow calls, I've got gift cards, I've got much more. To win some, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so I'm guessing we are all aware by now of the public event exploit you can do as a solo player. Basically, if you complete a public event, normal or heroic, in a really fast time, you can basically load back into the same area and you will then spawn into a different server and at about a 70% chance that public event will still be running, meaning you can grind it again. I've done this up to four times on a certain planet which I'll showcase to you guys in this video. But the main point of this video is we have found a way where you can do this in a fire team so you don't have to run this solo. And doing this and farming public events in a fire team, as we all know, is miles, miles faster than doing it solo. Now you can basically do this public event exploit within any planet and any public event. But the fastest ones to do this are, many people believe, are on Titan within the rig area. You've got the Witch's Ritual event and you've also got the Spider Tank event. If you're in a fire team, you can do these within a minute easily. But in my opinion still, the fastest place to do this is on Nessus and within the Artifacts Edge area. The public event that spawns here is called the Cabal Excavation. And to trigger this public event as a heroic, you simply at 40% of the public event have to take out a ship called the Thresher which patrols the area. If you are in a fire team, you can literally do this in seconds. Once you've done this, a yellow barred boss will spawn in called the Excavation Valus. You can take him out in a matter of 20 seconds easily. You simply then pick up your heroic loot, which as we all know, heroic public event chests love to drop them exotics. Now if you were doing this solo, what you do here is simply load back into the same area you're at, which here would be Artifacts Edge. In doing so, you would load into a new server with having a good chance that this public event is still running. Now this is how you do it in a fire team. Now the two other members of your fire team, not the leader, need to fast travel to another area on the same planet. So if we're on Nessus and we're using the Artifacts Edge area, the two other players in your fire team would either fast travel to the Chamber of Sky within the Exodus Black or the Watcher's Grave. As soon as the fire team leader sees them leave the area, what he then needs to do is simply load back in on the area he's in. In doing this, he will load into a new server. When he loads in and sees the public event is still running, he simply just gives the call out to his fire team to rejoin him, basically fast traveling back to the Artifacts Edge area. Now we've actually in a fire team have done this four times in a row, almost five times, and we were only doing it for about 15, 20 minutes. So it is by an absolute mile the quickest way to farm exotics within the entire game. Like I said, doing public events in a fire team where you all can hear each other will be an absolute breeze. Now, if you think you have a better place to do this, you have a better public event which you think you can do faster, you can use this exploit there. There's nothing stopping you. The point of this video is not the actual public event I am using. The point of the video is showing you how you can do this within a fire team. So simply when you're in a fire team, once you've completed the heroic public event and you've collected that loot, the two other members of the fire team, not the fire team leader, need to fast travel to another place on the same planet, while the fire team leader simply loads back in to the same place the public event is at. In doing so, he will spawn into a new server, see the public event is still running, gives a call out to his other two fire team members to load back in on him within that same area they did the first public event. In doing this, you will have a full fire team grinding public events all day, every day. And you can basically fly from one planet to the other and grind public events for days doing this. It's definitely by an absolute mile the fastest way to grind exotics in the game. Beats doing this solo by an absolute mile. And on that note, guys, I am out. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, leaving a like really helps me out. Now I'm going to leave you guys with one question. Who wants to walk? With DPJ, subscribe if you do. Always in the wrong.